Hi everybody, just wanted to make a quick video on updating the uh, Resolve EV controller. Uh, you want to take the four screws off the back. Um, pretty simple. Take the cover off and look for the USB-C port. If you don't see that, you probably uh, want to look at Dollar's instructions because that is, you probably have the micro USB version. So let's get started. Hi guys, I'm going to give you a quick overview of how to uh, update the, the newer um, Resolve EV controllers with the USB-C port rather than the micro USB port. It's pretty much the same, but uh, and I'll leave a link to the instructions that uh, um, Isaac has uh, in the link below, in the description below, but um, uh, sometimes you, you, know, you just want to see it rather than read it. So uh, first thing we need to do is we need to download the um, ST Micro uh, utilities, and there's a link in the instructions. It takes you to the ST Micro site, and um, you need to download this. Um, to get the software, however, you'll need to register. It takes a few minutes to register. Sometimes the emails take a while to get through, or get, they get stuck in spam. So you, you want a lot, uh, you know, some time to get the emails. Um, once that's done, you download the uh, installer and uh, you can run it. Let's see, where did I put it? Okay, this is the installer. Um, it's asking after you, um, it'll ask you to uh, install a new device in the middle of the installation. Uh, the first part is just the opening accepting the license agreement, clicking next a couple times, and you get to this part where it asks you to install a device. Hit next, and this will install the uh, ST Micro um, USB device. Click install on that, and finish, and the install will continue at this point. And you hit next, and we'll just choose to create the defaults in the start menu shortcuts next and we're done so at this point um, let's start the uh, utility you should see it in the uh, start menu okay before we continue I forgot to actually um, download the firmware file so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to resolve back to resolve ev.com slash update and we're going to choose down here the firmware file for USB-C. And uh, in my case, I'll choose Fahrenheit. Click on that. Downloaded. All right. We, now we can continue with the uh, ST Micro uh, utility. STM32 Cube Programmer. Let's launch that. Uh, let's click OK on this message. Okay, so we're going to click on this second icon here, the one that looks like a down, uh, the down arrow. And we're going to browse for a file. I have saved it in a folder called Resolve on my C drive. Go quickly find that get my mouse to behave and resolve firmware v2.8 Fahrenheit in my case and uh, according to the instructions we want to verify programming and run after programming once that's done we also want to plug in our device. Okay, uh, what I forgot to do is I forgot to select USB, then refresh. Once that's done, you should see USB 1 here. And what you also have to do is hit connect. Once you see the, uh, once connect is, uh, once the device is connected, you should, this should change to disconnect. And you should see some uh, memory addresses in, in this uh, screen. You can click on the download 
button again and we still have our file here uh, and verify programming and run programming is selected and we hit start and per the messages we uh, the instructions we have two messages uh, we can click OK on these and we should be done let's verify the um, instructions yep looks good um, these actually these two didn't uh, pop up but uh, I'm sorry these two didn't pop up but these did so let's see what's switch back to the program oh downloaded uh, verified successfully and file download complete okay we're good and that's it that's how you update your USB-C Resolve EDD controller.